I'm going to do my Siege Nighthawks first, and the reason being is because uh, they're pretty fast. Uh, combat speed is pretty fast, even though the range on them is really short. Alright, so here we've got all these different targets. So we have, that That must be that Reaver explosion thing, right? We've got like this Capitator crap going down here. That one's really freaking big. I don't know what's up with these. I'm, it just that uh, it looks like a cavitator field. Let me uh, let me put put one boat in there. I just want to see if it actually makes me surface. Yeah, it did. It did make me surface. I was just curious. But yeah, that capitator field is a monster. Oh, sweet. You can kind of see the remote targeting range there, too. So there's, like, just random cavitator fields throughout the target. Look at that, man. All these cavitator fields. Oh, you know what? That's probably from those... Uh, uh, freaking uh, Mort's things that that thing's chunking. It's it's chunking those uh, mortar thingies and uh, I bet you I bet you that's what is putting all those visible spots on the on the map. All right. Uh, let me do my scourge nighthawks. I'm sorry. Yeah, my scourge nighthawks. Uh, now these guys right here uh, they have a mix of torpedoes on them, scourge torpedoes. So these morts are, uh, they, they, they're like cavitator things. Uh-oh. Look at that, man. It's just messed me all up. All of my stuff has surfaced. <laughs> now, thankfully, it didn't do any damage. Yeah, these things are a lot tougher than I thought they'd be. I'm, I'm just going to turn around for a second. I, I think I need to learn about these pumpkin chuckers. I mean, look at that right there. They just made me surface right there. I'm just really curious how long they stay on the map. Or if they're like permanent. Wow, that was, uh, oh, here comes some more. Now, you can see these Nighthawks aren't nearly as fast as my other ones. I don't have any speed buffs on my torpedoes on this one. But, yeah, it's getting harder and harder and harder to hide as time goes on here.
man. All I can say is just wow. Mortars launching cavitator fields, man. That's Oh crap. I almost went in. 15 seconds will only work on these guys when they're um, sitting still. Definitely not when they're moving. Let me try my, my tiger sharks. Yeah. Yeah, and those ranges are pretty 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 stout too, man. Those cavitator fields. Um, I'll say the clock in the corner up here can be your friend. And I'll only say that because um you know, you can watch the clock and see when it's 15 seconds, right? I'd, all right. So that one's up right now, and it just went away at 24. 24 minus 15 is 9. Oh, man, I've got no torpedoes. Oh, Darn it, I just got busted. And he's chewing me up. Oh, everything had splash on it. Wowzers. Man, that was brutal. That sucked, bro. Look how slow my fleet is now. It's going to take me four minutes to get what it took me 20 seconds to get to before. Yeah, that was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. But, you know, the fact is they're designed for to, to kill subs, right? It almost makes me want to see about going in there with something else. Let me, um, I'm going to go hit it with my Crusaders. What do you guys think? Yeah, well, see, um, this is my Siege Torp fleet right here. My this fleet right here is loaded with sticks. Load, loaded with sticks torpedoes. Let me uh let me try those real quick. Yeah, well, Trickster, you are a buzz kill, okay? <laughs> you're a buzz kill. Uh, before I even try it, you're going to sit there and tell me my, my my Crusaders. I mean, it's like, you know, at least give me the benefit of the doubt, man. Just, just don't assume that whatever I use is going to automatically die. All right, so, yeah, that's not good right there. And thanks about the haircut. <laughs> Yeah, that kind of negativity, man, is just not appreciated. That's all good, buddy. It, it's it's easy, man, when it comes to these kickside games, man, to be a. Uh, uh oh, that was at forty. Bam! Look at that. But you know what? Every one of my subs took damage off of that. Off that explosion, I took damage every one.
Now, does this guy right here, does he do random? Because uh, I'm kind of wondering if I can just go in there and sneak in on him and kill him. Crap, man, he just blocked off my access. Let's go try and retreat again. Just out of curiosity, how much damage? 20, 20 minutes of damage off of that. Yeah, well, they're going to be, they're, they, there's been talks to get rid of zombie fleets. You know what I mean? So I don't I don't know how that's gonna go. See if I can get in here. Uh, it's not looking good. Yep, there I'm surfaced already. Yeah, then things are a little overpowered right now, I think. What's generating the fields? Oh, uh, this uh, the morts that are coming out of the Hulk. See these morts that come out of the Hulk? Soon, wherever they land, they, they put a field. Crap, man, I got too freaking close to that one field. <sighs> Darn it. That's definitely the trick, is getting in there and getting to that Hulk. See, morts are inbound right here. One, right on me. Nope. Sweet. Robot, I hope you're watching, buddy. Yeah, you can pinch the Hulk, I would imagine, so. All right, so I got my retreat button up. And I would definitely retreat once you kill the Hulk, is because, quite honestly, it looks like the payout is nothing. Quite honestly, once you kill the Hulk, um, you got all those extra cavitator fields all over the place. And that's the only way to get rid of them, right? Oh man, I just barely made it out, man. That was awesome. Yeah, it took damage from that. Now I just got to kind of run away. I'm going to have to retreat again because he's going to be activated. And if I want him to park, 
I need to uh, keep my distance. You got one with banshees? Nice. I don't have a banshee fleet. This one here I'm going to commit to. As soon as that field is going to come back up here, and then as soon as it goes back down, I'm going to go in, and I'm just going to park there until it's dead. But yeah, there's definitely guaranteed damage, and I'm not going to lie, that splash is going to be really rough on the zombie subs. But right now, the payout on them is jack. Yeah, the sector I'm in, I'm going to have to look around and see if I can find all the drag queue bases. Ouch, but that was a ton of VXP. That was 27,000 VXP this got. So if you're trying to rank some subs, it might not be a bad idea even if you die. If And that was no crew. If I put a salty dog on there, it'd been double. If there's a double salty with two stars, a silver one, that was triple. So it, it would have been a crap ton of VXP. So I'm just saying the VXP on that is pretty good. Uh, this one right here got 71,000 VXP. 71,000. Hey, Phil. Alright. And just so people know what my builds are. Now, this guy right here, um, you see I've got no torpedoes on this one. So, it was really a bad idea for me to use this in all together. So, I would definitely completely ignore uh, what I did with my Tiger Sharks. I know it's a 17 and a half hour pair. That, that part kind of bites. But uh, quite honestly, I never should have put this fleet in there. Never should have done it. Um, this one right here, obviously, I did quite a bit better. Um, this was, um, I think if you had uh, salt torp bees, uh, the salt torp bees, probably, we, probably would have done better. Um, than my uh, scourge torps, to be honest with you, because I would have had the speed buff from it, and I would, uh, and, and the things they don't have any concussive resistance either. They don't have the corrosive, but they don't have concussive. So, in my personal opinion, I think assault torp bees on your nighthawks might be the best way to go right now. Uh, if you have tiger sharks, uh, probably probably suggest the same thing, assault torp bees, and uh, that's it. That's all I got. Yeah, but yeah, if you just want to go in there for some VXP, um, let me see. These are already legendary. These are legendary. These are legendary. Hmm. I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah, remove that ship. Oh, look at here. We got like a fleet of stingrays. Let's go in there with the, to find another one with the fleet of stingrays. Oh, uh, you know what? It's it's lunch break is over. I probably ought to be going. This is uh, just kind of a throwaway, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it real quick.
Jack face. I don't see any more. What are the VXP targets? Well, obviously at the relay towers, you have the Earths, and um, and then there's also um, the the Reaver thingies. Uh, what are the heck they called? Um, Reaver holdouts. That isn't what a uranium base looks like. I'm in a whole other sector now. I can't hit that holdout because it's buried. The targets are just, just way too many targets on the map right now. And they just blew up. That's funny. A whole bunch of stuff just blew up. Alright, I'm going to show you guys a trick real quick. Okay, now this is... Uh, this right here is... Uh, I'm playing in um, Facebook Games Arcade. But what I'll do here is I'm going to open it up on... Uh, Facebook here and I'm going to show you something. Okay, if you right click on the map and you go to inspect, holy crap. Somebody try to scare me? Hey Shane, what's up buddy? Alright, I got to hook Shane up man. Thank you Shane. Man, you're going to go broke man. I'm worried about you buddy. Thank you for that though. Alright, so anyway, you seen when I, I did that right click earlier, right, and I clicked on inspect? What that does, well, what it's supposed to do is open up a whole nother window. Let's see if I, it'll still work for me. Alright, it's supposed to open up a window that looks kind of like this. Um, some, depending, um, you, you may actually have it like, um, you know, a docked in with your browser or something like that. Uh, let's see if I can, let me see right here. But anyway, what I'm looking for, you click on the network tab, right, and it'll start showing um, uh, stuff. You know, let me. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on the world map here. World map. I'm gonna type in world map here in the filter, and I'm gonna go out into the world map. All right. So now I got all of these links right here to all, everything on the world map. Um, Drac stronghold, Drac mining base. Let me see where my boat boat is. All right, that's right next to me. That's awesome. All right, so <coughs> Reaver Fleet, Reaver Fleet, Zoe Fleet. Our modest sprite sheet right here. Let me look at that one. I'm gonna open that in a new tab. All right, so that's what I'm looking for. I'm gonna grab that URL right there. I'm gonna copy it, and I'm gonna open up my. Uh, Ad blocker right here. Go to options, filter lists. I'm sorry, customize, edit. I'm gonna type that in right there and save. All right. Now I'm gonna go ahead and refresh here real quick. 
Hey, take care, uh, Tiger. Bless you, son. Thank you. Said thank you. All right, let's go back out to the world map. Now, um, I'm blocking all the armadas. See, there's no armadas on my screen anymore. They're actually still there. You can see the names of them, but you can't actually see them. But what this does is it lets me hit the, uh, the holdout that I'm wanting to hit. Sorry, this black bar is because I got that other window open. But um, So now I can go ahead and hit this holdout. I know a lot of people don't like the ad blocker, but, you know, they'll be all right. Now, I'm going to die here pretty quickly, as you can tell. I barely even did any damage. Obviously, you're not going to kill anything. And look at the cavitator field. Holy crap. Can I just say holy crap? But you've seen how I got rid of the armadas. You can do that with any target on the world map. All, all you need is... Um, let me see here. Oh. Yeah. You out again? Where are you heading to, son? What? Parents there? All right. Okay. Let's just see what kind of VXP I get from that. Oh, yeah, it's no problem. Like I said, just right-click, inspect. Usually it's best to do it before you uh, get the game loaded up. But thankfully it still worked. But, of course, you want to see Amrata's again. You need to make sure you edit and pull that out. With there being just so many targets on the map, I, I feel like ad blocker is more legitimate now than ever. <laughs> Alright, let's see what kind of VXP I got. Granted, I only got half the VXP because it didn't really do much damage, but... Alright. Looks like I got a little bit of promotion. I got 36,671, and that's with the regular Salty Dog, so that's double. So without the Salty Dogs, I would have gotten about 18,300. Alright. Anyway, I got to get out. I got to go to work. Um.